Hey guys, so this is a bit of a different recording. I'm going to be doing a Lego model review, I guess, for my own creation. <coughs> so yeah, without further ado, let's get started. This is Billy, my virtual pet. Not virtual, but... So if we put the camera down at this angle, if we... So we've got Billy, the, the beaver, my virtual pet. Billy, say hi. Yeah, that's Billy. And to operate him, you need to take out his tail, very painful, and then poke him through there. If I can get it. Pops out his little collar. You've got to put the collar here. No, a little creation. Billy. You gonna like the Billy? Yeah, sorry about this. It's gonna be a few technical difficulties. And it's inserted. And we need to put his face back on. Anyway, so back to Billy. What you have to do is feed him. You get your little, bless, poker food. You get his mouth, poke it in here, so you've got here, so push it, so that's him fed. Then you see this little tray here, this, you can put, I guess, brown studs there, and it looks like you've fed him, it's gone through him, so you can see it there, kind of, and you feed him, then he comes out with poop. Now, that, now to reassemble him, you need to get him up in front so there's nothing in there because I've got a tray here. You've got to place that back in there. So that, so he looks like just a weird animal that I've built. Put that in the zoo. Then other people think, oh, he's just an animal and he hasn't, he's run out of blocks. But actually, if you put the tail up here, you probably could put him in a beaver enclosure and you wouldn't really notice a difference. But, obviously he's our virtual pet. And you can store all sorts of things in him. i purposely built, in fact I'll give you a little, I guess, sneak peek. There'll be a tutorial coming very soon. Just to open him up, that's all I'm going to show you. And that. But basically, if you look, you've got two little red studs. Sorry about this one won't clip in. I've broken the one by two block. There it is. And so that you can put all sorts of things in there. So then you get this piece, that's one which I'm you. And then you get this creation and just click it back on. Obviously, you'll probably do a better job than I have. And if you do not have one of those pointer bricks, you would have noticed that I've put a flat piece, a flat 2x2 two two bit, there, and a grey bit there. Now for another option, you could put them on loosely, and you could use something like this to lock it on, and prise it up, and then prise another bit up then you've got these two bits now this bit shouldn't come up but you should have put his eye back on should have these two bits now I've put them on so it's like that and this bit here even though it doesn't look like it it'll work exactly the same as this bit except it obviously won't have the tail feature I suppose you could shove it in there like that and pretend it's a beaver tail, but I personally prefer the curve on this. So if you go lock it in, it kind of goes up. So yeah. So yeah. And then you obviously, if you have the flipper bit, you can clip that on there. 
then boom. There it is. Now, if you want the tutorial for this, I'll make another one. Now, for now, this is Billy, the virtual pet, the virtual beaver pet. And if you want a Lego sweet machine, yes, I'm from England. If you want a Lego sweet machine, I can make one. Well, not make one. I can show you my Lego sweet machine. It's a Tic Tac machine. I may be able to make a bigger one for these things. Skittles. Like M&M's. Fruitier. So yeah, if you want a strong for that, then if don't I'll upload it. Now, if you want suggestions for anything, uh, hit that like button. If we can get to 15 or 16 likes in the first two, five years, that'd be quite nice. But obviously I'm saying first 15 or 16 subscribers in five years, hopefully I'll achieve that by about nine.